Colin. A review commissioned by the government has recommended that quotas for affordable housing be relaxed <clears> to help solve the UK's housing shortage. Sir Adrian Montague wants to encourage institutional investors to build more properties to let in the private rental market. I'm joined now by Liz Pearce, Chief Executive of the British Property Federation, to discuss this. The thing here, Liz, is that people want to own the homes they live in. They don't really want to let. We don't need more properties to rent. We need more affordable housing to buy. Well, I think we need everything. You know, we need several solutions to the problem of housing. Yes, we need more, we need more homes for people to buy at the right price. But there are a lot of people who would be very happy to rent if you could rent at the right price, at the right quality, if it was well managed, if it was in the right locations. Uh, I think some sort of landlords in the past have got a bad reputation. If you can actually sort of improve the quality of the sector by getting high levels of institutional investment into it, building much bigger and better uh, apartment complexes like the Americans do, like the French do, then actually renting becomes a very, very attractive option. The report advocates a private sector solution. What's wrong with the government solving this? What, what's wrong with the idea of the government building the affordable housing the private sector isn't? government can't afford to do it. I mean, the government does subsidise to some extent the provision of social housing, uh, but they can only scratch at the surface of what we actually need in terms of solving, solving the housing problem. A lot of these people who need places for the first 5, 10, 15 years of their, their lives are going to be young graduates, uh, people you know, like young lawyers, young accountants. Uh, they don't necessarily want to tie themselves down with a big mortgage. They want a decent quality place where they can pay a decent rent and know what they're getting. The government's borrowing costs are at a record all-time Low. Why not borrow the money? Uh, government doesn't want to borrow the money. Uh, you, you know, you know, the sorts of things you, you, you put on this particular programme. The government is very, very concerned about actually spending more money. Social housing, more council housing is part of the solution, but why not use the okay. private sector? Are you not concerned that uh, the announcement yesterday by Santander that it's going to raise its standard variable rate by more than half a percent, that's going to have more of an effect on housing than any of Sir Adrian Montague's proposed before. Well, with Adrian Montague's proposals, we're looking at a different form of housing. It, it, it's something that this country is not really very familiar with, this idea of a big, a big rented sector. If you can get the right sort of people investing in it, there is the money out okay. there to get in there, get returns from it and Liz provide Pierce, good housing. Thank you very much for sharing your thoughts with us. That's all from now. Plenty more, of course, on the website, skynews.com forward slash business.